Hi everybody, check this one out from BeforeIt'sNews.com. A patent filed by Microsoft reveals the company has voluntarily created software that allows the government to intercept, rerouted, and record all personal electronic communications, including Skype phone calls, which are directly named in the patent. It seeks to give the company exclusive rights to intercept personal electronic communications and resend them directly to the government and other agencies who may be seeking to spy on you as if we're not being spied on enough. The patent specifically names certain types of communications such as Skype calls, instant messaging, video conferencing software, meeting software, but it doesn't even stop there. It, uh, it can record all of your personal digital communications. Just about all electronic devices you can think of, <laughs> such as your computer, You can even access data which is stored and forward that to the government. Unbelievable. Let me just read this again. It seems to be a translation. Yeah, it's basically saying the computer. So, I guess if you're using a wireless connection, that includes everything on your computer. Microsoft appears to be trying to patent Skype spying. It goes far beyond the ability to just spy on Skype calls. Only by digging into the patent and you see the deceptiveness in Microsoft's labeling of certain technologies and you realize the true scope of what the software company is trying to provide the government. All data that is sent over the internet is a packet-based communication. Gaming systems, instant mes messaging protocols that transmit audio, Skype and Skype-like applications, meeting software, etc. Patton goes on and deceptively labels all digital electronic devices as computers. All digital electronic devices are labeled now as computers by Microsoft's patent. Everything from computers, printers, gaming devices, automobile systems, printers, home appliances, and all other mobile-based electronics are computers, according to Microsoft. It even applies to microcontroller, which are often the brain of electronic devices and used in products ranging from automobile engine control systems, so they can find out where your car is going whenever you use... Um, anything to do with uh, electronics on your car. Implantable medical devices, in other words, chips, remote controls, office machines, appliances, power tools, even toys. They basically want to spy on everything you're doing. Unbelievable. And multiprocessor systems, microcontroller-based systems, set-top boxes, the list goes on and on and on. I don't know whatever happened to uh, Bill Gates. Was he always such a sellout? Or was he, was he always? Like, I mean, it seems like that to me. 
So I'm even the least bit concerned with human beings, with life, with real flesh and blood. You know, why doesn't he put that money to better use? Yeah. So there's the patent application number right there if you want to look it up. Well, they're probably already doing it. That's that's what I figure. They're probably already doing it. It's probably been built into the Microsoft system already. They're just making it legal now. Anyhow, traders beware. I'll post a link to this article before from beforeitsnews.com. Thank you for watching.